Bill 277 will go into effect July 1st. This will force all children to receive the recommended vaccines to be able to attend school. News Channel 3 reporter Senator De Los Santos has more on how some parents are reacting to the news and some are possibly moving out of state. I'm here today as a concerned mother of two children, both of them attending local schools. As you know, the new mandatory vaccine law, SB 277, will take effect this coming July 1st. Concerned parents voiced their opinions during the Santa Barbara Education Board meeting Thursday discussing a newsletter they received. The Santa Barbara Public Health Department sent out information stating they will require all schools and child care centers to fax over all medical exemptions. The information that went out to the schools from the health department uh, was really focused on just how it was going to be implemented here within the county. The purpose is not that we're going to be accessing medical records from doctor's offices or anything like that. Um, we're just looking at those records to make sure that they have all the required elements as specified in the law. In order for children to attend public or private schooling, as well as daycare, they will need to be fully immunized and have it signed off by a physician. Some local families have already chosen to move out of California to protect the health of their kids when physicians refuse to issue a medical exemption. The only kids that would be exempt from the vaccines are ones with physical and medical conditions. If there is a valid medical exemption, the child would not have to get vaccinated and still be able to attend school. There's no such thing as one size fits all medicine. People can have bad reactions to, to anything, even something as small as a needle. But these are injections that we're talking about here. Well, I know that this is a very passionate issue for some people and they're opposed to getting vaccines and again vaccines are safe and effective they've been proven through research and through decades of experience uh, they're the best tool that we have to control the spread of vaccine preventable illness in our communities and for more information on an individual school you can log on to shotsforschools.org in santa barbara senator de los santos news channel 3.